Welcome friends to the part 3 of the first level of my donut tutorial series in Blender. So you can see here is a donut. In the last video we made it, we gave icing over it. So this icing is too clean and too perfect. I do not want too perfect. Anything is not perfect for human beings. So now it is drifting. It should be drifting. As you can see in the image it is drifting and this drifting effect how to get it. Uh, you can get it by going to edit mode and by clicking tab okay one thing my screen cast too thank you now tab then you will go to edit mode and then as you can as you know that in the last video I taught you how to do modify it in the edit mode by grabbing with my proportional editing on I will drag but one thing drag this one but one thing is that that donut base is selected I want to select my icing but here is nothing to select you select that you can go here and you can see that before donut base there is a edit logo as you can see here is the edit logo before edit mode and you can see here edit mode edit logo so it is editing this donut base I want to give it to my icing beneath it you can see there is icing and before it you can see there is a dot click on the dot the edit mode will transfer into the icing and it will edit your eyes sorry now if you I want to click here and then drag with my proportional editing decrease my proportional editing amount and then drag it down as possible not more yeah like that only something some points drag up, some points drag really down. It creates a drifting effect. But one thing, they are creating some holes inside it. This is because if we peek into the donut, you can see this one is getting entered. So this is a problem. The, this vertices are going inside it. So I will be doing and I will be fixing later. So do it by it. Do not copy mine. It is there is no no one said to copy mine only. So now go on like this and one thing that Blender Guru do it that to fix these holes. Sorry, sorry, sorry. There's a problem there. Yeah. Now to fix these holes, he what he did is um, he snapped it. What is snapping here? before proportional editing you can see snapping tool if you click here and in by side that drop down you can if you click on face 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 and i did but it became more horrible so i will be fixing with alternative method i'll be offing my this one this snapping tool and then yeah 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 doing this one do not copy mine as i'm saying do not copy mine it is I want more you can see it's now like a drifting effect is on there isn't it yeah 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 yeah, yeah. okay now I have finished with my this one I have done first you do slowly do not hurry okay to make my video short I am hurrying it's okay now I will go to object mode by tab and you can see there are holes I want to disable these holes so to go to disable these holes in the upper ribbon you can see layout modeling sculpting UV unwriting and more I want to go into sculpting inside sculpting you will see this one zoom in to get this one okay my screen cast tools do not get confused with my skin cast tool because you will not get with you defaultly so now here this is my donut and there is a small rounded surface with my cursor this is the size of the brush there is a brush here so I am not clicking if you click then it will draw like this if I click here you can see it is making drawing and one thing to increase the size here radius increase or decrease and yes to increase strength here increase or decrease strength you can also give the radius and strength from here also 
and the hotkey hotkey for changing the radius is F this is the hotkey and shift F is for strength okay now I will be editing this to I will first edit this one sculpt this one when I clicked you can see this is moving and if I click on tab it will go to edit mode and you can see this one was enter at first if, you, if I go to there it was entered and when I made it this one I will make if you it's not working like that zoom out and then do it will uh, work now more zoom outing okay. this problem I faced so now I have to go to edit mode and you can see these are bulging out here also you can see if I go to sculpt mode and then sculpt it here it is it's now out so it's very easy isn't it click everyone it will be you can do it by um, editing but one thing is that you can do it by edit mode but it is easier here okay now I will go to layout mode again because it is done with my donut icing and it is looking like a dripping effect but one thing as you can see in the image that this drifting effect is here but I want more drifting here because this if you see here I want to give a deliberate solid droplets to get it there again object mode eh, sorry edit mode now I will I will select one this one this one I want for getting um, droplet effect and from here I will select this one by shift selecting here and then exclude it by E okay one thing my screencast tools I will exclude this E then it will go down it will not affect this one if I would drag this it will affect that one but I do not want to affect this 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 line okay do not want to affect this this line okay so now you can see there is a droplet here also I want to give one E then exclude it I want to decrease its length how to decrease its length you can simply click here uh, S one thing you should know that G for grab right clicking it to get to my original way R for rotating right click and then another thing is scale sorry I have clicked sorry I have clicked on A that's why okay scale for scaling it you can see if you click here it will become pointed and if you click here it will more get what I see so I want a pointed not so pointed but pointed this one is okay I want this one to also become a pointed edge enough now go here take out this one do not exclude only one vertices because it will give you horrible effect okay, I have sorry 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 then scale it okay one thing is a problem with my scaling here problem go on this is okay I think I want this one I will select three here or by going this 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 you may not see most of it most of the vertices because it is really what I would say that it is really making it as it is a solid object so it is making it more it is making it more. this one goes so down I do not like this one so I will drag up So I will delete this one click on delete and click on vertices I will delete this one it is okay now it, it was two now you can see there were how many one two three four five four I want a more here I want I want five here 
so get five here clicking on here then executing it then scaling it sorry scale rather than box here okay okay one by thing yeah ah uh, proportionality decrease its size then grab it then grab it like this also okay that what why i was talking that you may not see most of the um things because it is a so, we have created given a solidity thing isn't it that was the only thing that we have dot and that's why it is not showing most of the vertices if we click here in this monitor way in the solidity modifier in this edit mode now we can see all the vertices here again we if we again click it it will show all the it will not show every vertices so okay now something is wrong here with this that gone inside it sculpting will help me out from here and here i want this one this 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 is yeah yeah okay now it's now a good donut and it's really um, good so here here so now it's okay but one thing is there is that here one face is selected as the g is very close i am doing this i will delete this vertices here it will affect anything here no as i have face selected that is a problem doing it doing here that as i am face selected there oh, 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 oh. there's a huge problem here sorry sorry yeah there's a huge problem here isn't it i want to delete this edge here delete edge to delete 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 where it gone the problem there i have clicked f here yeah it's gone now delete edge the problem that i faced i am discussing you i was really i thought that it has gone it has gone wrong and i am discussing what it happened it really happened that g the g button in the keyboard is really very close to f and h what would f do what f do is if you click here and then give f it will create another face here you can't see it now i will see here else it but it's very annoying if you click here and then click f you can see it's a face it's creating a face this is a hot key for face and what is this h h is what if you click on h you will see it's hiding it's very annoying to unhide you will go to alt h and it will unhide everything so now it's we are up with the do not and you will see it's got a drifting drifting effect so let's end our video here and we have created now a very Mm, good donut with uh, icing with its drifting and more realistic and i want to make it it's now well and in the next video i will sculpt my donut more and make this more realistic for our final render so let's end our video here thank you guys till then goodbye stay safe and stay tuned for more and more videos